It's one thing taking these cities, extremely challenging, though it's proved. But what about holding them? How many Russian troops do you think will be actually required to hold Ukraine if it means occupying these cities? Good morning, Isabel. In my opinion, and based on my own research, if they were to hold these areas, God forbid that Kiev falls and um, this enters the second phase, which would be, in my opinion, a very robust insurgency, as Ukrainians have already said, um, they're going to resist forever. Um, they would need hundreds of thousands. I mean, the classic counterinsurgency numbers, even the, the coalition never achieved those numbers in Iraq. And that wasn't, you know, that was like 1% of the population that was a part of the insurgency. This would be uh, horrific for the Russian military, and they would not be able to hold a lot of these or just face opposition every day. I mean, it, it's, I'm not going to say it's easy uh, for those in Ukraine to say that they're going to stay and fight. Of course, it's a terrifying situation for them. But once we start seeing heavier bombardment, do you think that that determination uh, on the part of the population to fight back will dissipate? Or do you think that there's something unique going on here uh, that we haven't seen in any recent conflict? No, I, I think that 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 overall feeling is is valid. Um, I, I did not think, to be honest, that that the reason that the Russian plan, you know, they attempted like a, a an Operation Iraqi Freedom, one shock and all rapid seizure of urban areas failed was the resistance. Now, yes, unfortunately, they're going the Russians fear urban warfare. They're not going to send troops in until after they bombed everything. Uh, for a lot more than they already have. And it's already horrific scenes of uh, civilian infrastructure. And, and that will break people. Um, I don't think it'll break them all, though. And, and it is, I had to go pretty back in history, pretty far back, where this many people will resist after continued military power like this.